Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. We're the Dauntings. My name is Rochelle. I'm your favorite Donna, and this video is all about Radiant Rochelle. Aw, thank you. So yes, in today's video, I have my $100 shopping haul um, from a recent bet that we did. I lost y'all, <laughs> but lost. I paid up. She did pay up, so <laughs> I am so excited to get into this because there's just... It was so hard. I really wanted another girly girl tumbler, but she has her shop shut down at the moment. Um, so I wasn't able to get that. So I bought something else. Not really what I super wanted, but it's something more that I needed. And we're <laughs> going to get to that. But first, let me just get into a couple of these smaller packages. <laughs> well, that didn't work out. <laughs> okay, so the first couple of things that I bought are actually kind of boring I guess to most people but they're gonna be super helpful for me and I have not seen them um, until now so I'm excited to see these <laughs> so these are for my bullet journal so for those who don't know I started bullet journey journaling at the beginning of this year um, to help with anxiety and just everything that's been going on with the world um, since March 2020 so it has really really been helpful and very informative as far as what I'm tracking and things like that so I'm gonna stick with it. I really do enjoy it. And I got some day of the week stickers. So we have uh, just ones that say Monday through Sunday, several different ones. So I got them in a, from a couple of different shops in a couple of different styles because not only am I bullet journaling, I'm, also, I'm actually daily journaling as well. And this just helps set up the weeks so I don't have to handwrite out because I don't have the best handwriting and I'm not very artistic. So to just have some stickers that I can label the boxes that I draw out for every day, it's going to be super, super helpful. So I am so excited for these. And I think, um, so these are just black ones, but I think I have some rainbow ones or metallic -y ones as well. So let me, let me check here. Oh, there they are. So I do have some rainbow ones as well. So I just picked these up off of some shops um, on Etsy. So yeah, this is, this is just the nerd me inside is like screaming. This is amazing. It's <laughs> gonna help. You have no idea how much it's gonna help. Well, actually, you do. You see me do it. Ah, uh, yeah. She spends all the time writing in her journals and, yes. and coloring in her journal. And hey, it, it it helps my mental health. So you know, I'm all for it. I'm thinking about doing in it, but I'm think I'm gonna go the sticker route where I can put yeah. stickers in my on journal. A, a planner. Yeah. Not journal. Not journal, but actual set in stone planners. So. Yeah, I'm thinking about it. I'm okay, thinking. so the next thing I have is from Amazon. Now this is something that on one of our rare shopping trips I did find in Barnes and Noble and I took a picture of it and it was $50 and it's something that I super super wanted and I went ahead and put it on my Christmas list but then once I won the bet I checked out on Amazon, checked out this item on Amazon and it was only $23.99. So I was like, guess what you're gonna buy me? So I said, okay. So here it is. Cause I pay my debt. Yes. So I got the Alexander Hamilton The Revolution. Now what's really, really cool about this is it has information about the actual musical, how it started. And I think it has most, if not all of the lyrics for the entire musical inside. So not only is it like history and background information on Hamilton, I get to see um, the actual musical as well. So there's images of the original cast and there's all this kinds of information um, about how Hamilton was put together. It looks like an encyclopedia. It does, but I mean, this is gorgeous. Do you I remember encyclopedias? We don't have them anymore. See, look, here are the lyrics to the Schuyler Sisters which is the fifth song in the musical, and there are the original Skylar Sisters. One of my favorite um, songs in the entire thing. Work! Oh my gosh, and then here's the pin and pad. So this is, this is actual images from the notebook that Lynn was using whenever he was creating the amazing story of Hamilton for the play, for the, for the stage. So I think this is going to be an incredible thing to look through, to learn, because I am still obsessed with Hamilton. So Cheers! I love Hamilton. I know my mom's going to love looking at this. My little sister is going to love this. 
So I think this will be really fun to look through whenever the family's here. They can look, but, but it's mine. They can look through it, <laughs> but it's mine. So I just can't believe Amazon had it for $23.99 and this retails for $50 everywhere else. So had to have been on sale. Had to have been, but I caught it at the right time. There so, you go. Okay. So this last item that I picked up with my $100 budget is the most expensive thing. It is huge. It's kind of flat. You might be able to guess what it is. Now, it's a pin board. It is a, it's a custom pin board from Graham Crafters. We have we several, love Graham Crafters. Yes, we have several of their boards. So I'm going to leave them links down below if you want to get one for yourself. But anything you want, anything, anything, I you think just we have like tell 10. them. I think we have and about ten. They'll come up with. You just tell them what you want, and they'll come up with different designs and you go. Just pick one. Which one do you, you like? Which one? Yeah, so I really, really wanted a Cruella board for my Cruella pin collection. But I had another collection that had a a, a need rather than just a want. She way ran out of room on this board, y'all. Like, they are Way like, run out. <laughs> I have just enough room to put, like, the, the pin post in the board and the pin hanging off of the actual way off. board. Because and they're a little crooked. It's like hanging there like this. Help! Help! So, I do have a Graham Crafters board for this collection, but I needed a second one. So, let me get this open and see it for the first time. I am so excited. I am so excited. Do you remember which one it is? Yep. Do you remember what the design was? Nope. I just remember who it is. It's so. my favorite princess. <laughs> there you go. Spoiler. Oh my goodness. Ow! Here, let me... You ready? We have Vanellope Von Schweetz. I'm my favorite princess. Check out the detail. Like, even though it's just a silhouette, like the detail of the wave on her hair, the little candy hair tie, and it does come with the hooks so you can hang it straight on a wall. And the one that I have right now is Ralph, and it's his silhouette. So they do um, silhouettes. They also do just like the head. Mm -hmm. um, your Maleficent is just her head. Mm -hmm. um, but her Loxo is the silhouette of his entire body. I have the... So's my hat box goes. Yeah. And uh, uh, my Ralph one is his full body silhouette. So I decided to do a Vanellope silhouette so I can hang them side by side and be able to give my Ralph pin collection some, some breathing, breathing room. room because it is ridiculous how full that board is so again here is Graham Crafters information if you want to check them out there and like I said I will leave all their information down below in case that's not coming out clearly um but we absolutely love Graham Crafters and I do anything want anything you want yeah and I do want a Corolla board but this this called for me more at this point in time. I don't see my Cruella pin collection growing anytime soon, but because I I collect pins from the entire movie, both Ralph movies, not just a specific character, there are so many more pins that I can get for this collection. So I am excited to now play with my new pin board and separate out all my pins because that's really fun to do. Like it really is. And she is so cute. I cannot get over this. She's gonna look so cute next to Ralph. She is. But she's about the same size as Ralph in pinboard form. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> but still, you're gonna know who they are. Definitely. And because so many of my pins have both Ralph and Vanellope on them, I can't separate Ralph pins over here, Vanellope right, pins over right. here. So I'm gonna have to figure out a way to separate. Maybe one will just be Ralph and Vanellope. And then the second board will be like all the side characters, King Candy, all of the little racers. All them princesses you got for that. Vanellope with all of the princesses from that mystery collection that came out when Ralph 2 came out. Yeah. And she got them all. I do have them all. So I'm going to have to figure out how I want to separate these out. But thank you, Graham Crafters, if you are watching, for creating this board. I am so excited. And we will be ordering another one. Oh, yeah. I don't know how soon, but I really do want one for Cruella. All right, y'all. Y'all see, <laughs> I pay, I pay my debts. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I have this. She got her stuff. She got to go shopping. Yes, and I had so much fun, but it was so, so hard <laughs> because I actually won. We knew that we won. That we knew that I won. Like back in the beginning of September is when yeah. we filmed it, 
and box lunch money came up, hot cash came up during that time. And so I was debating, um, cause this was the first thing that I bought because I knew this would take um, three to four weeks to do um, for us to actually get it. So yeah, I didn't, I didn't, it was so hard with all it the sales. It took forever to make up her mind. It really did. If, if, if it had been reversed and if I'd have won, I'd have said, let's go to Spirit and I'd have spent a hundred bucks back. like that. Yeah. <laughs> But you didn't win. So. <laughs> but I paid my debt. <laughs> so leave a comment down below. Let us know what you think about my shopping haul. Did I spend my money wisely? Well, you got stuck. It screams you. It, it does. does. And these stickers, like any style, I can always use Monday through Sunday stickers. Because this is going to be amazing for my 2022 bullet journaling. And daily journaling. Thank you. Well. <laughs> Don't thank me, you won. It was you, like paying a bill. I gave, paid a bill. You gave me your card and said, here you go. I paid a bill. <laughs> oh, all right, that's going to do it for us today. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye. Bye.